Hi guys, this is from Apple Expert. Today we receive a laptop with uh, liquid damage. We cleaned the motherboard with the ultrasonic cleaner and the motherboard worked but there is no backlight. And I'll just switch on the laptop. There is no backlight. So I'll try to troubleshoot this. Now, the first thing you would do, let me remove the motherboard here. Now, uh, this is MacBook Pro A1278. Uh, I think those they have a fuse on the motherboard. That's what I just go bad when there is no backlight. Let's see what we have here. Okay, so I'll I'll pull the schematic here. I'll try to adjust the camera so you can see clearly what we have in. This is the schematic for this motherboard. And basically what we have MacBook Pro, yeah, this is the 8202879 and let me look for this fuse well, uh, like, I've done this hundred of times so I know exactly which fuse is there so basically this is the fuse I don't know if you can see it clearly guys, hopefully okay so basically here we have the PB bus so as LCD backlight and this is the fuse we should have on pin 1 12 something volt and on pin 2 12 something volt if we have on pin 1 12 volt and we don't have it on pin 2 so the fuse is broken this is the easiest way to check it it's exactly 12.6 so now what I'll do I'll just pull it up and I'll check with my voltmeter if we have the 12 volt I should replace this voltmeter, it always give me a headache okay so I'll just pull up this and measure the voltage cause this fuse hopefully hopefully the fuse is broken okay now, I don't know if you see my voltmeter. Yeah, you can see it. Yeah. So, So I have 12.5 for on pin 1 and I have 0 volt on pin 2 which confirms that the fuse is damaged. So I'll, I'll just solder a new fuse. Hopefully we'll be able to see this. I'll do my best. you will not be able to solve this unless you only use ultrasonic cleaner sorry what the hell I'm saying unless you have a microscope Normally those fuse they break, but we I, I fix many of those where there is no problem with the fuse, but the resistors they have they they have different weird values, 
So either the fuse or the, the resistor, one of them, you have to check it out with your voltmeter. It's easy to do. And I'll be posting repairs. A couple of videos every week. Just so to help to help people doing the repair. I remove the fuse from an old broken MacBook motherboard. And those fuses basically you can find them on different versions of, the, uh, of this uh, MacBook Pros anyway. Just aligning the fuse on the pads. Here it is. Come on, baby. Here it is. Okay, I'm done. Well, basically, if this works, uh, I'll clean the logic board again with ultrasonic cleaner before assembling it and give it I'd give it back to the customer. And we do provide three month warranty, so just let this cool down. Okay, let's try it. First, what I'll do, I'll just check with my voltmeter if I have the 12.6 volt on both ends of the fuse. Just much easier. Oh boy, oh boy, don't do this. Just power up. Okay, my green light is here. So just I have my twelve point five three volt pin one, pin two twelve point five three. So now Let's see well, connected to the screen. Let's see if this really works. It should work though. I'll just connect the hard drive, the keyboard. Okay. Okay. So 
let me turn on the laptop. Yeah, and here it worked. Show you again. Yep, here you are. Let's try to boot from the thing. It used to be a black screen. There you are. See guys? I'm just rebooting the machine again. Let's see what's going on. Yeah, here, you see? Okay, it's time to collect money. Okay guys, I'll try to post more videos for max repairs. We specialize in liquid damage repair, uh, power failures repair. Basically, don't, don't change your motherboard uh, or logic board. We do fix them. We uh, don't charge for diagnose. So basically, bring your laptop and we will tell you what's wrong with it. You don't have to pay us any money unless we do the repair and we offer a three month warranty, sometimes more. Uh, you can call us anytime, appleexpert.ca. Thank you guys, enjoy it, bye.